I've had several comments lately asking about programming the Raspberry Pi, especially with Python. And, well, I'm not a professional, I'm an amateur, I do it because I like to do it. There are several tips and tricks I have so that I don't have to go back and reinvent the wheel so that when I start to write a program I can get it done quickly and I don't have to thrash through a lot of documentation to try to figure out what's going on. And the first step is to create a library, and I've got that behind me, so let's take a look at that. One of the things I do in Python to make programming a little easier is I keep a library of stuff that I use a lot and or stuff that's complex so that I do it one time, I learn it one time and I keep it and that way when I need it again I don't have to go back and read all the documentation and try to remember how I did it. I keep a working example of it. So let's take the first one here. This is a two-dimensional array and so what I've done is I took this from another program that I, I wrote in fact, this one had to do with a stepping motor, and I generalized it into an example. And so I created an array, and I made this uh, so that I can understand it in the future. I put lots of comments in here, so the next time I need an array, I can just copy this code. And uh, again, I don't have to go back to all the documentation and start over again. So as you can see, I've got things like for multi-dimensional arrays, binary shift. So we use this for the I2C uh, video, file read, file writes, uh, how to float uh, formats, uh, format floats rather, uh, formatting strings, things like that. So every time I do something new, I create a little sample program and I stick it in here so that again when I go to do something I don't have to reinvent it I just come here I pull it out I stick it in my new file and I can go from there makes programming a lot easier well that was the number one tip and trick on Python programming I hope you find this useful and interesting in your Raspberry Pi experimentation